Welcome back. I'm Dr. Amadi. I'm a foot and ankle surgeon in the Orange County area. And today I would like to discuss the cold heat laser. The cold heat laser has been used on various amounts of various types of pathologies. Mainly in the foot and ankle, it's been used on plantar fasciitis, tendonitis, synovitis, partial tear of tendons, complete tear of tendons, arthritis, wound healing, and peripheral neuropathy. Peripheral neuropathy is one of the main conditions that is not, sometimes is not treated by medications. And sometimes patients are left trying to seek any kind of alleviation for the pain. The cold heat laser has been used over 3,000 times with benefits and success on these different types of pathologies. One of the main questions asked is, does the laser hurt? The cold heat laser does not hurt at all. The patient has no sensation because it's a cold heat. Another question is, what is the difference between the cold heat laser and a hot laser? The hot laser burns and destroys tissue, while the cold heat laser on a cellular level decreases uh, inflammation and initially decreases pain. It also allows healing to happen in tendons, ligaments, and soft tissue. Can it safely be used on implants? Yes, it can. Has there been studies that have proven the effectiveness of, of this uh, cold laser, and is it FDA approved? Yes, it is. As previously said, 3,000 studies have proved the effectiveness of the cold heat laser. Going back to peripheral neuropathy, if a patient is diabetic or they have peripheral neuropathy from an unknown cause, and medication does not work on them, they're kind of left helpless. Cold heat laser is very beneficial. It may take up to 30 sessions, each session lasting anywhere between three minutes to 10 minutes on different areas of the foot and ankle. But the benefits are extreme. For any further questions, contact our website at www.orangecountyfootandankle.com.